Liz, hello! So, it was a time where there seemed to be two Geralt's. One was a cele- Oh, oops. Having completed da -da -da, he was meant- Okay. Let's go. This was a fun time, though, in his manner. I'm still confused as to why he didn't um, ever visit her. Like, what the hell happened with that? Beautiful moon. Oh, here's the... Sorry, Roach. Try to catch me, Roach. Try to catch me. I'm so excited to see how this ends. He lost his affection for her. Yeah, but what I'm confused about is how... How did his heart turn to stone? And is it... This is a rhetorical question, by the way. Um, is it hypothetical like is it a metaphor or is was his heart actually stone maybe we'll see you know if i cut him open is it actually a stone heart or is it metaphorical because he got so obsessed with the bargain and yeah i don't know i don't know we'll find out i don't think i'm supposed to know yet or maybe i'm I don't know. <laughs> Viva Ravidin? Wait, did he just say Viva Ravidin? Ravidin? Y'all. Y'all. Someone commented on my YouTube video and was like, you mentioned you were making fun of Trump supporters? Okay, yeah. Never watching this channel again. Because we were making fun of like Ravidin 2024 and make Radovid great again or make Tamaria great again and someone was like <laughs> someone was like I don't think she cares <laughs> never watching this channel again yeah it was it was weird let me see um might pick something because I was making fun of people who still have Trump signs in their yard look that is pathetic okay <laughs> That is really pathetic. Take that down. Take that down. You know, say say what you will of choose. At the very least, you look like you are a small person. If you have, like Radovid is dead. And they're like, long live Radovid. Breva Mama, hello, yes. You can adopt me and the entire community. They're still dreaming. Well, you know, you can you can have some you can have some dreams. Um let's sell some of Okay, so I do not want to sell that. I can sell this. Um what about like all of these? It says it's junk other okay butter knife is common please tell me if i'm buying something important that dream is called a nightmare <laughs> what about the jewelry it says it's junk it says sil gold diamond ring is junk. Is that true? Oops. No, that's a quest. That's a quest. <laughs> Yuna is having a break right now. I'll keep all her stuff. I don't know. Dismantle jewelry. Really? Seriously? I don't like dismantling. It costs money and I just want to be rich. I think that's something people, you know, I should start a, a course of how to be rich in The Witcher. 
um don't dismantle just sell everything sell everything oh dismantle for the jewels i am the power washing queen i'm i did absolutely everything in power washer i'm so depressed i don't have anything else to do it's so depressing but i haven't replayed everything so i think i'm gonna start from the beginning You know, I think I've done them all twice. Okay, so it's still fun to do them all again. Alpha, thank you. That's so nice. Sorry, I'm taking forever. I just want to make sure <laughs> that I'm not going to sell something important. Magic trinket. I don't know what the hell I'm so going to get from, like, as a reward, maybe from Gonter or even Old Geard. Probably nothing. Okay. Da 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 da. Aw, Dusty, that's sweet. In my head canon, um, Geralt is a man who knows that Yen will choose her own jewelry. And Siri is not even interested in jewelry. Like, Siri would rather have money for a tattoo, and Yen would rather be like, I want this exact necklace. And then he'd get it. You know? That's kind of like <laughs> with Caleb and me, so maybe I'm projecting. Be quick about it. Please, good sir, a bit of courtesy. So I look up, and Bob's your uncle. He downs half the barrel in one drop. <laughs> what is Bob's your uncle? Geralt, over here. Oh. Oi, wait your looks. Use the look of a man who knows how to drink. Thanks. Some other time. Hey, now. Hi, Random. Thank you for the reason. More treats. I don't think I can beat him. I don't think I can fight him. Oh my God, it's the, it's that challenge on TikTok. The freeze challenge. Show off. Of course I am. <laughs> Wouldn't you be? Time's a marvelous plaything. Gaunter. And a great spice to use in gingerbread. Oh, you remember so from the wedding. Indeed, occasionally I find time manipulation irresistible. Controlling it offers so many appetizing opportunities. Like spiking the soup of unsavory individuals with appropriately ghastly things. Evil Doctor Strange. Really? Gauntero Dim, also known Master of Mirrors. I love ah, you though. So you'd rather know what it is I do. In brief, I give folk what they ask for. You might say, I simply grant their wishes. And drop them in a world of hurt. No, not I. That would be their poorly formulated wishes. But that's wishes. tricky, dude. That's I'm no tricky. Cheat. I give folk what they want, nothing more. That the oft desire unworthy things. That is entirely the fault of their rotten natures. Who hurt You're you? You're not human, that's clear. So what are you? A demon? A djinn? Do you really wish to know? Yes. Yes. No, Geralt. You don't. This one time I shall spare you and not grant your wish. All who have learned my true name are now either dead oh. or have met an even worse fate. And I still need you. What? Oh my god, what if he's God? <laughs> he's the creator of everything. Hi, Emma, I love you. Have have a good day. Hi, Dino. Hey, Remy. You actually control time, or is this just some conjurer's trick? What difference does it make? A big one. Hmm. Let us say time has always fascinated me. So I taught myself how best Ooh. to use it. 
Why time of all things? What if he's like an Geralt, OG sorcerer? There are four dimensions. Length, width, height, and time. What would you have me fall in love with? Width? <laughs> Come now. <laughs> what the fuck? I love their dynamic though because Geralt is so down to earth and this bro is literally literally up in the clouds sitting on a table. So, to what do I owe the pleasure? I wanted to congratulate you. You acquitted yourself splendidly with all geared. In fact, you've almost satisfied your debt. Was supposed to fulfill his three wishes. Did just that. This is where you remove the brand, because we're even. Nearly. To fulfill the terms of the contract to the letter, you must do one more thing. Draw all gear to the temple of Ilvani. We never discussed that. Oh, oh my god. We did. As a man of the world, you should know that every contract contains a catch or two. Small print, which, nevertheless, changes the ultimate meaning of the pact. Jeez. This applies to oral contracts as well. Recall that I said, and I quote, I believe, however, that all will end well. And once it does, we three shall meet oh, and thank one another for the Oh, my God. End quote. Mm, yeah, I remember. <laughs> He's so Fulfill done. your end of the bargain. He's so and done. the brand. Jesus. That was the last time you interrupted me while I was talking. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh my god! What the devil? Why is there a fly in my soup? I was waiting. I had an eye out for you. Didn't see you come in. How is it you're here? How is he just unfazed by that? I'm real. Now. I can't keep. <laughs> Old witcher's trick. I concentrate real, real hard, and I can control time and space. <laughs> you toss this fly in my Oh, seat. shit. Oh, no. shit. Now listen carefully. Tell your oh. man to come to the Temple of Lilvani. It's south of here. Entrance is inside a cave. <laughs> What's the commotion? Lilvani's temple. Got it? Aye. Got it. Hold that. Your friend. The medic. She were here. Ask that you look in on her. What happened? Thanks. Unfazed. I know, right? Did you see? Stranger to the book literally dropped I love dead. the design of this. Like, what the hell are they writing? But I like the little drawings and graffiti and stuff. Oh, letter to Old Beard. The Dauntless. I write you this missive, my good sir, because I believe surprise attacks to be bad form. I wish to inform you that I will not tolerate any more such behavior on my lands if you choose to surround yourself with a company of lewd rabble. I think I've read this before. Bye, Breville Mama. Have a good day. Thank you, Warrior. I think I've read that. So let's go check on Shawnee. Optional talk to Shani. Of course I will. You choke to death on Of three course I steel. will. Am I in Oxenford? Yes. It's kind of cool that it went back to Oxenford and not Novigrad. You know. Shiny. Random, thank you so much for that oh, resub yeah. again. Over. The spoon. Yeah, I don't want to see. That's that really got me for some reason. Hey, Mac. Like the caretaker. Thank you again. It wasn't. And it feels like you go to a small city and then you go to a big city and then you go to a bigger city. So it's really cool that they bring you back here. Instead of just staying in the big city. What do you need, Shawnee? Shani. Oh, Geralt. Good thing you're here. What's up? <gasps> what happened? Somebody break in? The pig is there. Yes. Uh, no, just getting ready to move. Oh. Uh... What? When, when? Where to? 
Not what I wanted to talk to you about. Or at least not only, but... I'm leaving, Geralt. The Eastern Front beckons. I'm Kedwin bound. Never mentioned you'd be moving. Any intention to, either. I didn't know I would be. Found out this morning. Two soldiers came to my door, said Redania needs me again. Couldn't turn them down? Just say no? Uh, perhaps I could've. But I didn't want to. Treating the ill and wounded, it's my calling. No place I'm needed more than at the front. I love her. I can't hold her. No, I can't hold her back. I mean, Geralt doesn't hold anyone back, and that's something that I loved about him and Yennefer's romance. Because with Triss, you have to ask her to stay. I don't know if you could end up with Shani, but like... You have to say don't go but that's not really an option with Yennefer because they both just do their own thing I understand any chance we'll see yeah, each it's other her again? vocation someday I'm sure he's gonna watch her grow old that's so sweet. learn anything about old geared well I abandoned the books quickly Decided that if I was going to learn the truth, I'd need to find someone who knows it. Ooh! Find anyone? Turned out I didn't need to look far. A colleague at the Academy, an assistant to Professor Pramathine Shakeslock, claims Olgird von Everick met with the Professor multiple times. Ooh! Apparently, Olgird asked the Professor to do some research. Professor got so worked up doing it, he went daffy. Started jealously guarding his notes. Wouldn't even let his assistant look at them. The Professor. Where'll I find him? Here in Oxenfurt. Cloistered inside his house on Academy grounds. Mage hunters guard his door. Hmm. Mage hunters at the door. He under house arrest? I can't say, really. Some of the faculty think him a traitor. Say he sold out to the hunters for a hefty pouch of gold. The assistant, on the other hand, insists the Professor wants him there to protect him. I don't know what from. What's your guess? He's certainly useful to them. A specialist in black magic and the occult? Must be a trove of knowledge. If he's really gone off his nutter, I wouldn't be surprised to see them using him. Mm. Need to talk to this professor. We'll go together. Redanian guards all over the academy. Doubt you'll get in alone. I guards love have never her. Stopped me. You know that. Mm. Wound these? and I'll have to patch them up. <laughs> Besides, we might run into a friend, get inside free and easy. Okay. Ow! <laughs> so how are things at the Academy Very these smooth, days? Carol. You mean since Radovid shut it down? I mean, is it well guarded? <laughs> might be all it is. Many of the faculty <laughs> fled to the far north. The braver ones stayed, but assumed the guises of tailors and laundresses. Why? Just curious. Scholars seem to have adopted mage tactics. They in the same bind? So the Eastern Front, and then? Depends where they send me. Wherever it is, take care of yourself. Always do. So don't worry. Oh, See, like, her kind of confidence and, like, don't worry about me is delivered in such a in such a confident way in self-assured way versus Triss who's like for example but don't worry about me Geralt I'll be okay Ugh, I just want to lay on this feather bed what the hell why so many books halt by order of King Radovid, no one's allowed inside the academy. Not even lecturers? No one means no one. See, you've become quite the stickler, Norbert. You were much kinder when I was patching you Ooh. up. Oh. By the way, how's your knee? Fine. Dandy. As if no arrow ever struck it. Consider yourself a lucky man. Mm. As if I'd not decided to operate, you'd be a cripple to the end of your day. Hell yeah! <clears throat> Bruno? Hey? Yes. Maybe we ought to let her in. She's a decent lass, 
Not like to steal nothing. Hmm. All right. Well, alone. Which will draw too much attention. I'd rather not get chite from the captain on his account. Nope. Here's what we'll do. I'll go in, then help you sneak in. How <laughs> are they back. not hearing this? <laughs> Don't know, but I'll figure something out. Usually aren't nearly as many guards on the riverside. Agreed. All right. Let me in. Oh, I love her. I love that she's so helpful and saves people and heals people. But then she's sassy as fuck. And she's like, remember when I sewed up your knee, bitch? Wait. I said going through the back. Do I swim? Eh, I'm gonna... F oh. I'm gonna follow the white dots. I don't know if that's correct. It's the horse on the lads are licking. Grab him! The what? Um... Oh! Nice, Dora! <laughs> you. Why? How many distressed damsels have you <gasps> rescued of late? I believed I was special. Oh my gosh, the one I walked home! <laughs> you actually do manage fine on your own. One thing I've learned is that you either let the lads beat you, or you learn to beat like the lads. So long. And, uh... Work on your guard a bit. Geralt. You're dropping it too low. Come on, Geralt. Grilled chicken sandwich. Dora the Destroyer. Hey, boys. Hi, Charlie. Good time zones. Oh. Geralt of Riviera, I presume. Mm-hmm. Uh, I hope I wasn't supposed to be on the bridge. Very nice. Yeah! Nice. Thank you, boys. I appreciate it. What a woman. Yep. Um, let's see. No. What did I want again? I wanted a oh, red. I wanted to make a red one. Another red one. They're so hard to find. Hey, Dadlow. How cool was that shovel? Oh, fuck. That's not what I meant to do. Okay. Psst. Are you there? Yeah. Right in. I'm here. Hi, Johnny. Grab Welcome. Where'd you get the rope? Long story, but we've done well. Professor Shakes. What house did you do? <laughs> Witch hunters guard the door. Doubt I'll be able to sweet talk them. Been a huge help already, Shani. Thanks. It was nothing, really. You'd have done the same for me. If you wish to see I'm me again before I go, her. I'll be at home. Packing will take some time yet. All right. Be seeing you. Ah, I love their relationship. It's such, it's like a basis of friendship. It's so cute. 
Eden, thank you so much for the two months. Um, Declan re redeemed ad time, so we're gonna chat a bit. Um, oh my goodness, Eden, thank you so much for the freaking 10 gift subs. I'm so excited for those people and they get to watch the VODs if they miss anything, ad reviewing. Thank you, so sweet. It has the juice, it has the juice. Um, yeah, I mean, if there's a pineapple moment, I don't really know what it's about. How's Boomy? He's really good. He's thriving. He was a little shit to me this morning. Quite literally, he does this thing where he goes behind the desk and he poops in the corner and it's really hard to get it. So I have to like crawl underneath my desk. Um, and it makes no sense. I mean, I know that's what happens with puppies. It's like right now he's at 50, 50% 50 of like pottying outside and then also pottying inside. And I would say 25% of the time he potties on the puppy pads. Just got a nature's miracle everything in this freaking. Ooh, okay, Tira. Hi, Celtic. Oh, Boomy. Yeah, and he's very bitey. Yes, I am, Johnny. Anyways. Make a hard save. La 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 la. What? There's a point in this quest where if you don't see her before a certain point, she'll leave and you won't get to see her in this quest but i'm already in the academy i'm confused because i'm already in the academy johnny thank you so much for the prime sub oh i can't put it on that okay that's fine shawnee's like a melody in my head yeah i've heard about that debt laugh he will go outside though. That's the thing. Like he'll go outside. Um, I think we just have to be diligent about potty breaks at this stage. Yuna would just straight up not poop outside. It was really hard. They're just different puppies. Oh, so cool. <laughs> I'm obsessed. They can be, yeah. And he's so worth it. He's the best. He's so cute. After stream yesterday, he just like literally crawled onto my lap and was, um, and he just laid on my lap while I talked to Caleb. He didn't even sleep and he was so he's so cuddly and they're just i don't know i love i love my sheeps i love how different they are with personalities um can't we wait until after christmas why oops sorry come on come closer why i will kill you This is my favorite weapon. <laughs> um, what were we talking about? Oh yeah, they're just different personalities. Yuna is very selective with her affection. Um, but when she is affectionate, it's like the greatest feeling in the world. 
because she'll decide to like lay on you or lay beside you and it's just so cute but boomy's always very affectionate but he's always very naughty too he's learning how not to um before you go to the temple okay yeah yeah um he's learning how to bite softly and stuff but he i guess it's like boy sheep girl sheep but he's very cuddly very very cuddly but he's naughtier than her he's 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 naughtier he gets into things chords she never got into chords he it's like ever he loves to chew furniture cords rugs lock tight need another way in you leave a window open maybe did you just knock on the door <laughs> hello boys just be naughty yeah thank you ellis yeah it sounds like boys mm-hmm exactly like yuna was so good this morning she was so cute she peed and pooped outside obviously because she's perfect she can be naughty too sometimes but like he his energy he can be so cute and sweet and then out of nowhere it's just like i'm gonna rip off your pants i'm serious like i'll be walking and he will take our pants like that's why i'm wearing leggings more now because if, because if it's sweatpants if it's any kind of flowing thing a dress he tugs on it so hard <laughs> it's ridiculous never dealt with that with you <laughs> um i don't think that's <laughs> okay he sounds like a cat he is oh Oh no, are you okay? I'm sorry if I scared you. I didn't mean to. I am gonna rob you though. I will rob you. Silver Lamen. Don't know the sigil. Hasn't been used in ages, looks like. Shattered mirror. No sign of impact. Probably not an accident. Shattered by a sound, maybe. Someone look at it and scream. <gasps> um. <laughs> uh. Anyways, what was I gonna say? Oh, I was thinking about the what the dog said yesterday about it's like beware of the the man of mirrors and like the riddle seemed to be mirror. So. It was like, don't stand in his way. Something, something. Reflection. <laughs> Nailed it. Julian Alboco's lesser key. Tomes about demons. Dusty as they come. It was like, uh... Reflection that can't be broken. Franco, so I guess that's not a mirror. Leave the bed pan in the usual spot. And take the platter. I shan't be eating today. Hi, Ruby. Thank you for the 13 months. Professor shakes lock. Who the blazes? How'd you get it? Get out. I know nothing. Don't wish to know anything. Understand? No, no, no. Out. Not gonna hurt you. That demon sent you. I'm sure of it. Could be a self-portrait, but that can break. Ego? That can break. What demon? Feigned ignorance. <laughs> Gaunter. Please, you know. Twin. Gaunter, old dim. Evil incarnate. Well, twin can break. He didn't send me, but he is why I'm here. I'm a witcher. <laughs> a mutant. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Could be. Why are there guards outside your door? You a prisoner? Protective custody. That's the phrase. Protective. <laughs> when I cannot decide my own fate, cannot breathe without their permission. What do they want from you? 
You may not be aware, but I am one of the foremost experts on the occult. Living experts, that is. My mentor was the outstanding Professor Lionel Van... And you're cooperating with the witch hunters now? Cooperating? <laughs> As if I had a choice. They're ignorant. But not enough to ignore what I know about magic, witches, sorceresses, what have you. Knowledge they use for barbaric ends. But that's beyond my dreams. Control. Sorry, I'm still thinking of the riddle. Dream like a dream yourself in a dream. Came here because I need information. Think you might be the only man who has it. Hmm. A witcher. Then it follows our need and fear. I'm hardly a post-conjunction creature. Mm. What did Olgierd von Everick want from you? I curse the day I first set eyes upon the man. <gasps> he appeared at my doorstep one day, offering a sack of gold were I only to find out who Gaunter O'Dim is and how to get rid of him. I agreed. Such matters are my speciality. And I needed the coin. I pored over countless tomes, delved into obscure incidents and analysed folk legends. I went so far as to travel to Nilfgaard, the library there, where at last I hit upon the mysterious entity's Wait, trail. Wait, do you know his name? There are records of encounters dating back thousands of years in many cultures under many names, but always as evil incarnate. In this land, we call him Gaunter Odim. At times, Master Mirror or the Man Evil of Glass. Incarnate? In deciphering the ancient scrawlings, I went blind. <gasps> Yet I learned a great deal. For example, that he plays with his victims and thrives on pacts above all else. Oh, shit. Seemingly harmless contracts which drive their parties to madness. Damn, he's worse than I thought. Oh my god. <laughs> At other times they refer to him as Twitter. <laughs> At other times they refer to him as acid reflux. <laughs> I hate acid reflux. It's the worst. It feels terrible. <laughs> know anything else about the man? I'm sure he's a really nice guy if you get to know him. <laughs> he is evil. Evil which assumes various forms. Forget about him or die. Oh. You're alive. Alive? Yet I live in constant fear, born of what I've learned about oh, him. Oh, shit. It's like, ah. Uh, oh, my gosh. This is creepy. But if anyone can figure this out, Geralt can, you know? What's with the surroundings? How to deal with him, These at rooms, least. What do they mean? They protect me. Can I Here, like evil <laughs> cannot touch me. How do you know? <laughs> Told me himself. Paid me a visit once. Oh. Fascinating meeting that was. I was blind already, but saw him clearly. He smiled at me. Said he was honored I'd taken such an interest in him. Oh. He my wished God. to thank me and explained he'd taken a similar interest. In me. <gasps> he drew the circle and said I'd be safe with This him. is optional? His way of repaying me, you see. Ever tried to leave it? <gasps> if you'd heard how he said it, you'd be as certain as I am what leaving would bring. Oh my god. Olgierd, if you knew what you were dealing with, why did you bring him into it? Olgierd signed one of these pacts with him. Brilliant deduction. But have you guessed why? Right, Grimmer. You must know that he came from a wealthy, influential line. He must have, if the family of his betrothed accepted him. Yet did you know his fortune soured? Mm -hmm. He himself became an outcast, yeah. impoverished. Iris's family, a powerful house, could not right. accept this. Would not marry their daughter to a noble. Right. Olgierd wished to elope. The further away, the better. Yet Iris refused to Aww, cut her family down. I mean, yeah. Quite the predicament. Indeed. Their luck turned yet darker when a wandering witch mentioned a solution. A man who would grant any I want wish. Flemeth? His name... Flemeth, what are you doing Flemeth. in the Witcher world? The rest follows naturally. Olgierd and Odin meeting at a crossroads. A wish, a pact 
signed in blood, and a price to be paid. Olgird was to sacrifice one he loved. Old Dim delights in difficult choices. He knew Olgird loved two in this world. His betrothed and his blood. Blood. <coughs> Olgird chose, and soon thereafter married his What? Beloved, his fortune restored. Oh my god! Olgird tell you all that? He had to. Oh How else my was God. I to diagnose his case? Make it sound I like did an not. illness. It is worse. Many illnesses are <sighs> treatable. But play with evil. Medicine can be much harder to find. Mm -hmm. Wait, I want to hear that first part again. Olgird I'm in shock. tell you all that? He had to. How, How else was I to... Okay. Make it sound like an illness. It is. It is. It is. Okay, cool. So did Old Geard kill Maybe his own brother? Maybe he just set it up. No, yeah. no, no. Deduce, Witcher. Oh, Dim acts directly or indirectly. Right, so it just hmm? set it up. Old Geard merely signed the blood letter. The blood the letter? Day, his brother was and dead. And then Vladimir wrote that? He wrote the letter to him. Because he doesn't know. It's the way I love Vlad more than old Geard now. It's so sad and he loves his brother so much. And like Gonter was so rude to Vlad. Why was old Geard out to get rid of Odin? <laughs> I want to replay this wanted. already. Had he? His heart had turned cold as ice. His feelings for his wife, mm. who he'd sacrificed his brother, had withered. He'd lost all he loved. Had okay, so it was guilt, shame, no, regret. Dim grants what you wish, not what you want. Oh my All god. All sign a pact, learn the difference. <sighs> Die by it. Oh, no way to get rid of him? Kill him, you mean? Kill evil? <laughs> no. Yet the annals tell of a man who dissolved his pact. By defeating old Dim at his own Yeah, game. that's what because remember Meaning, that one demon that thrived Dim wheels contracts on despair traps, and we tricked it? Wits. That's what I think. We could trick him. Challenge him to such a duel. Okay. He'll agree. And can be beaten. But remember, there is only ever one stake. The sole thing he truly desires. Human souls. So he really wants old geared. Odim left a mark on my face. Any way to get it off? A mark? No mention in the tomes. Strange. Unless... Unless it will disappear once your pact is fulfilled. If I challenge him, end the pact that way, will it go away? That I do not know. Uh... One man who succeeded bore no mark. The one man who succeeded bore no mark. I mean, I don't really care. Like, Geralt can keep that. I don't think it's that atrocious. If there's a way I could fight him, like challenge him. I fought the caretaker. I fought Olgierd. I think I could do it. Good. And if I keep the mark, Very that's good. okay. Oh, we can make it into a flower tattoo. So oh, the challenge is Gwent. Living in fear. Why, it's pleasance itself. <sighs> I don't, I'm not a Gonter or Dim Simp anymore. circle of dim created terrifies me i cannot see it but i know it is here i know no name for the sense which with which i perceive it when i near its bounds strange shivers shoot down my spine 
This is not pain, but something that stands my hair on edge like a hedgehog's quivers. A month has passed and still I stay within the runic circle. Nightmares prey on me more and more. I've come to fear sleep. I know not how long I can withstand this. So like, does he, I wonder if he eats or if Gaunter just keeps him in a state where he doesn't need to eat. I don't know. I dreamt I had a daughter. This was strange for I've never had children yet. One day, one came to me in my sleep. She was no older than 10. She called me daddy and loved me deeply. I could see it in her eyes. The strangest part of all was that I also burned for her with a great paternal love. Can one possibly dream of someone who does not exist? Can one love such a one? I no longer fear sleep. Perhaps Odim has decided to give me peace. I have no desire to change his mind. My dreams of Amelie give me great joy. My daughter is a good and clever girl. I believe she will grow into a wonderful woman. A shame she exists only in my dreams. Not only do I no longer fear sleep, but now I cannot wait for the moment in which it comes. What a fantastic transformation. If nothing changes, I shall soon try to leave the circle. I know now why I dreamt for weeks of the child I never had. It was his doing. This night, my daughter died. She caught a strange illness which pocked her whole body with hideous oozing sores. She cried, begging me to help. I could do nothing. She died in my arms. I awoke soaked with sweat. I remain a wreck. My mind tattered. Three months have passed since Amelie's death. My heart still bleeds and horrifying visions plague my every movement. I'm a blind man who wishes he saw nothing, for utter blindness would be a relief compared to these tormenting visions. I cannot persevere much longer. I have become a deeply unhappy old man. I have now lived within the magic circle for a year. Thoughts of suicide haunt my mind ever more often. It would be so simple. I need but step outside the rooms. <sighs> the essence of evil is to cause suffering. There exist many varieties of suffering, from common corporeal pain to the rarefied torment of the psyche to deep wounds dealt to the soul. Whence then does evil arise? Does it appear on its own or does it only spread when conditions are ripe? And finally, the most important question, how can evil be defeated? Most believe evil has always existed for none remember a time when it did not. Yet is that sufficient proof? I dare to doubt it for I am a scholar and the essence of scholarship is to question all hypotheses until they have been rigorously proven. The appearance of evil is closely tied to the existence of good, its opposite and antithesis. And like, I know Geralt isn't perfect, but sometimes when I see him talking to Gaunter, I really feel like, okay, good and evil. And that doesn't mean that's like perfectly good and, you know, perfectly evil. But, you know, to see Geralt like push the bookcase up and stuff, I don't know. I do feel like he is, he personifies a hero. It's like the end of season of storms, the epilogue. He personifies protection and heroics and stuff. Um, wait, I just want to see who wrote this. I don't know. Gian, Jill, or Jillian Albaco. Evil wears many faces and appears in many different forms. One of them wears a skin of flesh. This evil incarnated as man travels the world sowing death and suffering. Such evil is devious and difficult to discern. We usually only note its presence when it is already too late. In my scholarly, scholarly wanderings through the myths and legends of a great many cultures have come across descriptions of a certain individual which all display a striking similarity. So he's common through cultures. I do not mean in terms of this individual's outer appearance or name, but of his modus operandi. This evil works through trickery, attempting at first with the offer something seemingly good. The price one must pay for this object of temptation, however, is enormous and non-refundable. And the promised good often contains horrifying hooks and treacherous traps. Beware then of any who promise the impossible, for such can only be delivered through the machinations of evil. Hey, Titan! Something might happen if you put out the candles. Okay. Sorry.
That's it. <laughs> Gontor's like, go upstairs? Question mark. Y'all, if you are leading me into a jump scare, you're done. You're done. Diary of a Filer. Oh, upstairs, upstairs. Stop, I'm scared. I don't want to. I don't see anything. There's nothing. Casper the friendly gun. I know it's like its own fucking game, right, Alpha? I cannot. Okay, I think he just hissed. He just got mad. Okay, guys. This is intense. So... I will... I will fight Gaunter. I guess what y'all were talking about was whether or not I do this optional quest. <laughs> That's wild. Um, but yeah, I'm glad I did it. Hi, a very small bean. How you doing? <clears throat> Have you had any coffee yet? Me? I'm drinking coffee. I'm drinking my first cup. But should you find Gondor? He might be personification of pure evil, but he's also really attractive. Well, it was, it's mainly his voice, you know, like, and for me, I might fuck around with an evil demon, you know, that's, that's always fun, <laughs> but in the long run, nah, -uh. and I, I don't hate him still because he, I don't know. It's like he serves a purpose. You know what I mean? It's weird. Oh, I have to go see Shani. I might fuck around, but I... Oh! He almost died from that, you... Jesus. He's nice with us! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> He likes Geralt. I wonder why he likes Geralt. I think he's amused by Geralt, you know? Because he is so powerful and capable. And Geralt should really be a villain by now. After all the shit that's happened to him, the friends that he's seen die, all of that, I feel like he should be a bad person but he despite all of it he still tries to do good he tries his best hello ah. show me oh wait gaunter what i wanna i wanna play gaunter and gwent that's the thing i need to play gaunter and gwent Oh, you have a lot of money. Thank you. Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Whoa! 
Why is this robe so good? Where did I get this? Pineapple. Where did I get this shit? Is this better than the master crafted? Is it cute though? Iris's bedroom. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna go <laughs> do my threesome meeting. Me, Olgierd, and Gaunter, and I'll just show up in Olgierd's rope. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs> I'm excited. It's a copy of Olgaird's drip. You must wear it immediately. My <laughs> there's a meeting, yes. Ooh, handcuffs, kinky. <laughs> Great. I'm out of control. Uh bad yen isn't here she'd totally be down oh my god i'm excited straight up wearing his clothes <laughs> i'm dying <laughs> hey all geared Hey, what's up? <laughs> Found this. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. I'm not going to wear them. <laughs> not for the end. Shit, he's looking good. Chance to stun. Oh, sorry. Uh, let's do Quen. Two. Okay. Now I'm going to go oh. see. I'm going to go see Shani. Oh, oh my God, the chest. Guys. It's done. Oh it's my done. God. It's done. It's done. Uh, yeah. It's raining. Of course, it's going to be done. Yes. Okay, so. West. Um, I forgot where her house is. Wait, no, 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 I remember. Here. And was it here? Nope. But it was like close. Are there coffin peeps? Coughing peeps. Hi! Yes, girl. Okay, what is y'all's problem? Why did you make me? Why? Why? See you later. It's not funny. Who told who? Who was so adamant about that? Prank? No, we're not laughing. Hey, I thought he was right. I remember she left and I had to reload a save. Wait, what? I think people want to control you. I, 
I'm with Keeney. Or maybe someone missed last episode. Oh, right, if they didn't play Gwent. Yeah, so I think people missed last episode and thought I didn't already talk to her. Okay, anyways. Oh, they didn't go through all the dialogue in their run. Right, so they, like, missed it before. Right. Gotcha, gotcha. I don't want it to be rainy. I want it to be sunny. Did you watch the last episode, Warrior? Yeah. Well, it was last episode when I played Gwent. Played Gwent with her. It was really funny. Yeah, it's a clip too, so you don't even have to have a sub to see it. Um, it's a clip. I think Val clipped it. Because <laughs> he's like, we have we didn't see her since the romantic night and um it was really fucking funny come on roach she's like gerald gerald of course i play quint run roach Uh, I should probably do a hard save, right? Because I could fuck this up. I hope I already didn't fuck it up. Oh, Itachi, that's sweet. Thanks. <laughs> Am I supposed to... No, I'm not supposed to be in here. because it's raining so hard no I just uh... I did save, huh? Thank God for hard saves. Yep. Why did it tell me to go? Why did the white dots tell me to go out? See, it's telling me to go out. I can't see. I don't want it to be black and white. Why? Let me get a torch. I do think we'll have to be in emote only mode for this last quest. I'm not looking, by the way. <laughs> so if anyone has tried to spoil, I'm simply not looking. Um, but still. <laughs> oh shit. Oh shit. Ah. Gondor's just watching like, you 
stupid fuck. Damn, really had to choose the most elusive spot. Guys. Okay, I don't understand. Where am I? Oh, goodness. Strange choice of locale. Yeah. Guessing there's a reason for it. I don't know. <laughs> oh, he looks so good. <laughs> You're an art lover. Thought you'd appreciate the place. A witcher with aesthetic sensibility. Forgive my disbelief. They're talking sexy to but each since other. since we're here, I believe you have something for me. Fulfilled mm -hmm. the third wish. I have your violet rose. How do I know this to be the rose? Very well might have picked this up at the Oxenfurt Market an hour ago. Look closely at it. Got it from Iris. It was the last thing that bound her to this world. What? Iris was tired of living half alive, half dead. Thinks she just wanted it to end. Can't blame her. I condemned her to terrible suffering. Iris. What a mess we made of it all. We? If I'd only known we? then how it would end. What's happening? I feel as though... As though... A hot iron's pierced my chest. <gasps> Can you feel again? Acid reflux. Gonter's literally acid reflux. Waiting. No, sir! Seriously? <laughs> so glad to see everyone's. Oh my god, I would be this extra too, though. A little less trouble, lighter in the heart. So he was manipulating. What do you want? What do you mean, what? What? Your soul. You forget. The pack states you can take it only once you've fulfilled three wishes and... And we stand together on the moon. <gasps> well, what do you know? What? No. We... Wait, I feel bad. The moon is there. There! I feel no. bad. I gave you what you wished for. Here, on the moon, our contract you fulfilled. I feel bad. Yes. You cheated me. I never cheat. Yeah, you do, though. Don't get... Oh, no. Help, help, help. Wait. I feel really bad. Do not interfere, Witcher. Remember what I did to the last fool who interrupted me. Oh my god. Shit. You grant wishes, right? Grant mine and release him. <gasps> he must repay his debt. Let him go, and I'll take it on. We'll call it mine. Oh. You wish to give your soul for his? No, but we can play for them. I what? lose, you take mine and all Geert's. But if I win, you release us both. Gwent! What do you propose we play? Gwent? <laughs> Don't know. <laughs> Maybe we can bet He's like, on a challenge. <laughs> well, if you, know you I'm mentioned good it. At accomplishing the impossible. Seen me do it. What? What is it? Very well. God. But we shall do this my way. What is it? What do you want? No. <laughs> I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck this up. I'm gonna fuck 
this up. What's happening? You wish to play. So let us play. What? I shall tell you a riddle. No! Solve it. <laughs> and both you and all Gerd will be free. And if I don't? <laughs> then we'll all three go for a wild ride. It's what you proposed, is it not? The riddle. Let me hear it. He's focusing. To all things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Fondle me and ogle me till you're insane, but no blow can harm me, cause me pain. Children delight in me, elders take fright, fair maids rejoice and spin. Cry and I weep, yawn and I sleep, smile and I shall grin. This makes me think of a mirror. What was that supposed to be? You tell me. What but it can't be as simple as a mirror. Didn't quite catch the riddle. <laughs> Mind repeating it? <laughs> to all things and men I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Because some people don't want to look in the mirror or their Fondle reflection. And ogle me till you're insane. Yeah, you can look but at your no reflection. Blow can harm me cause me pain um your children reflection. delight in me elders take yeah cause they they don't Fair want to rejoice and spin yeah old people don't want to see it themselves cry i feel like mirror is really weep. obvious yawn and i sleep smile and i too shall grin okay let's do this leroy jenkins you're going down <laughs> We shall see, my friend. <laughs> you must find me before the sand in the hourglass runs out. Okay, so we have to find some mirrors or something. Ready? Let's begin. What's confusing me is the not breaking. What is this place? <laughs> you like it? There's a path. Plenty more where it came from. Just remember... You must find me before time runs out. I know, but what? Well, I mean, if I have to find him, then maybe it's just him. Uh oh, there's a crossbones! Oh shit, 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 shit. I don't think that's the answer to the riddle. Okay, no. I don't know if I should just run away from them. I probably should just run away from them. So it could be him, but he doesn't do that. He doesn't do that. He's a master of mirrors. So if it's... Reflection, reflection. What is this place? <laughs> you like it? I mean... Plenty more where it came from. Just remember, you must find me before time runs out. Oh, this song is so creepy. I see something over there, but I don't know. What is that? It's a well? An empty well? Is it water? But there was no water in there. But it was sparkly. I guess you can't break water. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. Die. 
I'm scared of this music. Okay, I see something up there. Ooh, a house! A swing! Children delight in me, elders take fright. Fair maids rejoice and spin. No, it's not this. Children and young folk like swings. No. Be scary to old folk too. No, Geralt. It's not yeah, a swing. It doesn't fit the other verses, it's though. not a fucking to all swing. And man I appertain, and yet by some am shunned and disdained. Fondle and ogle me till you're insane. Fond oh, oh. No can harm you're doing pain. Mm. What could that be? Death. You are always <laughs> I don't want As to. As I see it, you will never find me. Never. Never. Do I go in the mansion? Oh, okay. Ooh. Mirror. So this is where you're hiding. <laughs> Come now. You didn't expect it to be that I easy, know, that's you? what I was saying. I didn't expect it to be that easy. Okay, three mirrors. This is like Trespasser DLC. Fuck, I don't know. Do I go in the mirror? Care to wager on it? Give me water! I want water! Stop, 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 stop. Or maybe I keep going in mirrors. Ah! Ah! This, this! There's no water! But there's something I can look. There was water here once. Maybe there's a way to bring it back. Okay, I think he. Oh. Trap it with Erden! Trap it with Erden! <laughs> uh, magic lamp. Igni. No. There was water here once. Maybe there's a way to bring it back. Maybe let's try Ard. Maybe there's water somewhere else. No. Water somewhere else. I'll still get you. So you say, yet I wait and wait and nothing. Okay, I know it's gonna crash. Doing that forever. Care to wager on it? Water. Gotta be some mirror here you won't shatter. <laughs> I know, but where's the water? Seek and ye shall find. Perhaps. Mm. Wonder how you'll shatter a sheet of water. I know, but where's the water? I'll still get you. So you say, yet I wait and wait and Maybe wait. I have to shatter all the mirrors. Is there water anywhere? Water. Water. There was water here once. How do I bring it? Oh. Oh my god. Rushing water behind this wall. Break down the wall and the water will rush through here. See yourself, see yourself. Gotcha.
the clap was like when Old Geard clapped. So, any better? Yeah, thanks. Wine's revived me a bit. This plonk only could Geralt a corpse, could do that. An exquisitely rank vintage. You know what, though? It's good at last to taste something real. So, have at it. Tell me what the blaze has just happened. Your brand's gone. <gasps> it's Guessing gone! Guessing that's a good sign. Yay! Aww. Okay, I think you're safe now, chat. Unless, I mean, I don't think there's anything else. Or if I did something wrong. <laughs> I don't know. First off, you tell me what it's like to have a heart of stone. <sighs> it's wonderful at the start. You feel no fear, no angst, but also no concern, no care for anyone, not even those you loved. And gradually, you lose them. Well, you know how it ended. So he really did give him. What about your senses? Taste, smell? All there. A sword? At first. I savoured the world like never before. It was stronger, more clear. How's that possible? Apparently, I, I missed a sword. I did not wish for a heart of stone. That was a mere side effect. Oh. I wished to win back Iris's hand and have my fortune restored, and then to live like there was no tomorrow. And thus I lived until. Until I cease to feel anything at all. What a joy to be done with it. Because I am done, right? Will you tell me what happened? Okay, so he did give him a non-feeling heart because of what he wished for. Um So what is this what is this sword? It's a Witcher sword. Okay, I just, yeah, I agree with my mods because why, why would you say that so soon after and be like, is anyone going to tell Meg that? I do want to tell him what I did. Oh, Dim decided to have some fun at my expense, devised a game I was supposed to lose. Seems he'd forgotten the training you put me through in doing the undoable. Yeah. So only to protect myself. In doing so. I put you in harm's way. Forgive me. Oh. Mm. Well, don't have to worry about him anymore. You're safe and free. I thank you. Though I've no notion what to do with this freedom now. Mira took everything. Everything I loved. All I held dear. Not true. Got your heart back. Oh. A bitter victory. Now at last I sense how much I've lost. Yeah. I have a heart again. Yet all it feels is grief, sadness, and defeat. My life is a ruin. Don't worry, it'll all work out. Can't say I envy you. As the saying goes, careful what you wish for. Oh, I shall be. Believe me. Actually, I have a better idea. I'll never wish for anything again. It's time I took fate into my own hands. Live life anew. And truly, this time. Yeah. Sounds like a plan. I'll never forget what you did for me, Witcher. This is so romantic. I have something for you. Can't accept this. You can. Yes! I must. Yes! This saber's been in my family oh, for generations. Oh, hell yeah! Even when I'd lost all else, it remained at my side. Means a great deal to me. All the more reason why I can't take it. Do me the honor. 
This will mark the start of my new life. And such a weapon could be right useful to you. Aww. Thank you. Ow. Sorry. Iris. But he's bleeding and it hurts. You needn't be. I thank you again, Geralt. And good luck on the path. Good luck mm. to you too. Those are some bros. Wow. Oh my god. Oh. Jeez. <gasps> that was so good. What is that? Who's that? That was so good. Looking in a mirror. Concept art? You know, I feel like they could have taken any of Sepkowski's works and like based it off of that but the fact that this came out of nowhere wasn't based on anything in any of the books they're so creative they're so talented they're all amazing that was so good it was based on a polish legend nice I love the music director. Whoa. Um, let me see this sword. Oh my God, I love it. So I'm going to really quickly look at that Viper. I don't necessarily want to play that again to find Viper armor. I'm just, I want to look at like the master crafted. Oh. Um. I don't know. I don't really care about that. I don't really care about that. Check out the alternative path. Do I have to play it? Yeah, I like the other. I like the wolf one. So the viper sword steel stat. Mm. Yeah, I don't really want to play that part again. So do you want you guys want me to play through the other one? React or should I? There's no master Viper sod. Oh. Play through it or react to it. OK, cool. Was it a diagram? Just react. OK, cool. Can someone link a YouTube video? while i god that was so good guys that was one of my favorite dlcs ever it just the story was so good the twists were so good the fact that he was a fucking demon at the end um the twist that he set up he sacrificed his brother for his love and ah uh, so, there's just it was so well written. I feel like it could have been a separate game and I would have spent like $50 on it. Read description virus. Okay. Yeah. People told me it was, she was Van Rowe, which is really cool. We're only halfway through the whole game. Yeah, right. 
Thank you. Oh, Fluffy Ninja Llama. Hi, Unifax. Herschel Walker has a history. Oh, shut the fuck up. Sorry. Uh, first, I'm going to read the the character description. Herschel Walker has a history. There ain't no way I'm I'm not voting or voting red. There ain't no way. Okay, so stop it with you stupid political ads. Um, characters. Yeah, who just might have considered death a relief. I thought that too with him, sadly enough. I was like... He probably, this probably would have been a relief and it's really sad, but also kind of poetic and beautiful that he died right, right after he said, oh, I could be of use to someone. It feels good to be of use. You know, it's sad though. Yes, I did, Delaf. Um... She liked the courage, however, to delve into their cause. Olgierd's heart had turned into turned into stone, turning him into a monster. Iris hated what her husband had become, but could not stop loving him. The couple endured together in a painful cohabitation until Olgierd ended it by abandoning his wife. Iris never came to terms with their separation, could not, in fact, even bring herself to read her husband's farewell letter. Yet the violet rose he gave her upon leaving she kept making it a focal point for all the longing and love raging in her soul when she died these unresolved feelings kept her spirit in this world and continued to cause her suffering the winters the winters the witcher's intervention helped iris accept what had happened to her and her husband when he asked for the rose she agreed to give it to him knowing this would put a final end to her pain and suffering and also her very existence She's so beautiful. Oh, my God. I love Iris. He could at least do a last good deed. Yeah, I would rather die 100% than live like that. 100%. Oh, I'm also interested, if it won't spoil, of watching the alternates for the, the heist. Geralt came away from his meeting... With Professor Shakeslock knowing of a way to outfox Master Mirror. Okay, tell me this, y'all. Okay, first of all, his portrait is really sexy. <laughs> Let me just say that. Um, even in his demon form, I was like, okay, okay. Uh, but so if you didn't do that optional quest, you couldn't help Olgierd. You would just have to not intervene. Um, the demonic pact maker could be lured into a wager, win it, and he would be defeated once and for all. Yeah, he's just amused by tricks. Geralt soon discovered Professor Shakeslock's words were true. Master Mira could indeed be defeated at his own game. Geralt made a bet with him, wagering everything on one battle of wits and won. Yes, I love how he was like, he forgot that all of this, like, because Geralt has had to figure shit out and solve riddles this whole entire time and he didn't realize that he was training Geralt <laughs> to be a master of wits too he drove the demon from our dimension though I fear he may yet return his kind always returns that's basically what he said in the demon language right hi Gabby happy international lesbian day of visibility No, Ingo, I don't feel like he's truly evil because, for example, he commented on Shani and Geralt's love for each other. Like he could sense something there. Um, I think maybe if he spends more time as a human, it's like the op opposite with Olgierd. Um, he like feels more human things the fact that he can feel amusement amusement is not an evil trait you know 
I just don't think he's pure evil. The fact that he would even accept the wager, the fact that he ex he finds fun and excitement in games and riddles and words. Um, I don't know exactly how much of him is human, but maybe if he spends more time, I don't know. I just don't, I don't believe he's true evil. He wanted to cultivate the relationship just to make them feel more pain later. But I don't agree with that because Olgierd's heart turned to stone, stone. And if he wanted everyone to feel, I know he did that with Professor Shakespeare, but um, he turned Olgierd's heart to stone, which was like he was left unfeeling. Anti God. I agree, Julian. I just think he wouldn't he wouldn't be as interesting if he was pure evil. Oscar, thank you for the hundred bits. Because he's he's explain even ego, ego is a human thing. Thirteen months. Or like a. Ooh. Yeah. Rudy, thank you for the 13 months. He's very proud. Yeah. yeah. I'm so glad you liked it. Exactly. Um. Yeah. Yeah, we don't know much about his nature. It's true. The trickery. I mean, Loki comes from a place of pure pain, you know, but he also does get amused. And I wonder what his origin is. Like, what if it, what if he was, I don't know, like he had a terrible upbringing way, 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 way back when we don't know the origin of him. Yeah, Illuminati, that's very true. Someone already, um, someone already copied and pasted his words, the translation. So is this the bad ending? <laughs> I mean, is it necessarily bad or is it just different? Strange choice of locale. Guessing there's a reason for it. You're oh. a lover. <laughs> Thought you'd appreciate the place. A witcher with aesthetic sensibility. Forgive my disbelief. But since we're here, I believe you have something for me. Fulfilled your third wish. What is this? A canvas and on Reflection, it, house, exactly, Ingo. Wife, it's like a human creation. This yes, so I, I totally to agree on. with Ingo. Not the first time, and it's been my downfall. It's an it's a reflection of, oh. So beautiful. She looks alive. Wait, why is it? She is in a way. Iris painted this, then entered it. Wait, what? This is if you don't Ow. have the rose? Think she missed you. Oh. The real you. She wanted the pact to expire so you could be yourself again. How you were before. No matter the if you price. don't take the rose. Okay. Iris. What a mess we made of it all. If I'd only known then how it would end. What? What's happening? I feel as though... As though... The hot irons pierced my chest. We? Yeah. Oh. Oh. 
sorry to have kept you waiting. So glad to see everyone is perfect. How do you feel, Von Emmerich? A little less trouble? Lighter in the heart? Or dim? What do you want? What do you mean, what? Your soul. You forget. The pact states you can take it only once you fulfilled three wishes and... And we stand together on the moon. Well, what do you know? So why did he help Geralt find Yen? Why did Gaunter help with Yen? Genuinely asking. What? No. We... We had a pact. The moon is there. There! No! I know, it's such good... It's such good voice acting. Here, on the moon, our contract you fulfill. Awesome. He already... He already, um... But he saved his life. I never cheat. But then he saved his life in the boat so that could have been it it is done oh! Your soul belongs to me. Oh! that wasn't the pact it was the he saved his life oh It's over. We must meet again one day. Business with you is pure pleasure. Oh. Gonna remove the brand? Ah, right away. Done. Now, tell me what reward you've chosen. Oh! Wanna know where Siri is? So that's if you don't... Tell me where to find Siri, my adopted daughter. I know. Sadly, I can't be of service. So he can't Why even. Not? There are certain things even I cannot meddle with. Siri is hidden from my gaze. She's beyond my reach. Oh but shit! Finding her is not She's what so powerful. Most, because you will. I'm certain of it. So what should? A great danger lies in wait. If you wish, I can tell you how you might Siri evade it. Siri is so Unless powerful. You prefer to ask for something else. God, I love it because it's like it's so so scary. You know who Siri is. But Siri so can even Siri can overcome it. Well, even Geralt overcame it. From any danger. Then there's a few things you must remember. There will come a time when she will come to you defeated, resigned. Find a way to make her laugh. The snowball There will come thing. a time when one will betray her. <gasps> Let her vent her rage. There will come a time when she will grieve for a friend. Grieve with her. <gasps> there will come a time when fear will engulf her. Instill courage in her, but do not act in her stead. And never, ever... Let her feel as if you've sold her out. The money, the money what? with, um, what now? what's his Off face? To find another poor fool. Haven't decided yet, but I do know if I ever have. Th I don't think this is death, the bad ending. I turn to a witcher. I think this is just an, uh, it's weird, but singing his own theme song. Jesus. Uh, yeah, Jenkins. I like that. I mean, I kind of, I can see how if you got that first try exactly, like, uh, or... If I got that, I wouldn't have been like, 
no, damn it. You know, I would have been like, oh shit, guess that's just what happened. I don't know. But old geared. It's kind of bloody barren. Kind of similar. It, it can be, yeah. Well, not really. Anyways. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. No, he is and not today, out of I'm going to show you a very cool detail about Gunther Odim. You can see him in many places while playing Hearts of Stone. <gasps> For example, when you spy ah! to the Hearts of Stone, you can see him in the background. You can see him two times at the wedding. In the auction house. Where? Where? <gasps> oh my god. When you try to save the dwarf. Oh. And when you do the heist. <gasps> Please let me know if I have missed some spot and also let me know what do you think about this down below in the comments. So if you like this video give it a like, dislike if you think it sucked and see you next time. Thank you. <laughs>